Let me first talk about Ivan. Ivan was very dangerous. Ivan come with pickaxe, cutlass, fork, everything Ivan come with. When I it is January 3rd, 2024. And like most of you, I am sitting here on my veranda, awaiting, looking out for burial. It's your girl, Anselina Versatility Boyd, the channel where you get a little bit of this and a little bit of that. How is it in your area? What preparation? have you made for burial do you think jamaica will be devastated by this hurricane or are you still hoping that it will pass over us have you made the necessary preparation well i was expecting burial's arrival from early this morning i know that um it was said that we would be, um, or we will experience its effect from daybreak, before daybreak, leading up into the afternoon. But here in in a global climate now, but here in Southeast Clarendon, is division to be exact, Raymond's district. We are not experiencing. A lot of effect we are just getting some some little drizzle nothing much today earlier earlier we would have heard a lot of knockings as persons would have been repairing their roofs and their windows for the arrival of burial and you know um, you know browsing through social media because you want to be in the know you want to know what is really going on with this storm so i saw on the gleaner where they shared a timeline of hurricane that would have impacted jamaica over the years um 1980 we had hurricane allen can I recall the one day guess why we never found that the time day. <laughs> We never born but Gilbert I can I can recall some somewhat about Gilbert I was still I was I was a toddler I was a baby at the time of Gilbert just about I'm um, approaching two years old I remember my rooftop never forget that the rooftop came off I have that image clear in my mind then following gilbert in the eighth night after 1988 we have um we had hurricane michelle in 2001 at that time i would have been in high school then we had two major hurricane following michelle hurricane charlie in 2004 then hurricane ivan oh god in 2004 also ivan was the cool one um i remember ivan guys ivan just it's like I, ivan just come and he just sit down it's like he never decided to move at that time i wasn't home with my mom i was in high school at the time i was up by my sister i tell you guys when I ran the fear of funny black, me said just as my sister said, Cherry, get up off I bed and come. She had called me over for your room. I blocked that drop right which part me did then. So Uno oh no, no know me. Eh? As the mother did I said this morning, Uno oh no, know me. Mm. But then then I agree with it. Then follow Ivan we had in 2005. We had Dennis and Emily. Me no remember. I mean, let's me the funny. Me, 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 I do me, me video. Yeah, tell me if you get up, you can't wait. Get up, Cherry. Um, 
we yeah, have Dennis and mommy remember the chair I love skin out so I don't know oh you just come bring up with your big self and the chair why I put it on the, the, the rug. Dennis and Emily I mean I have much recollection about um, those two I don't know you can tell me if you're watching how devastating it was how did it impact Jamaica then we have um, Dean I can recall Dean because my sister's father was buried on that day we never feel much impact well it didn't really affect us here um a lot dean didn't really impact us a lot here um i can recall right shortly i guess it was like a few hours after the burial then when we came home we started getting the rainfall and the wind and everything i recall standing at the back window and just looking out watching the, the trees dance the trees were just dancing in the wind and then we had in 2012 hurricane sandy i cannot recall much about sandy but i know we were impacted as well not very much down this side but i think in the kingston area port more and so forth they were um mostly impacted by um sandy and I think that was what 2012 and I don't recall us having any other major major hurricane thereafter and that is about what 12 years 2024 yeah about 12 years so today I am here and we are tracking burial what do you think how much will very impact Jamaica um, it is uh, we're getting a little rain now it is after 10 after 10 I'm trying to see the time it's after 10 3 minutes to 11 to be exact and we're getting um, it was a little drizzle earlier but now it's starting to get a little heavier and I can see the trees dancing not a lot of wind but the trees the trees are dancing in the nice wind <laughs> at this time so um i'm going to let you hear what some persons have to say about their preparation and how they feel about this hurricane after so many years jamaica not being impacted by any major hurricane how do you feel about it let me know in the comments how do you feel about it what are you expecting did you prepare i went to the supermarket yesterday guys i may I tell you i learned because i'm not being a national after work i went to the supermarket and i line me a feet child in order to go in and when i get in so well when i was standing in the line a lady came out and she was like they are repacking the shelves i'm like they are packing shelves i should say yes they are packing shelves when we go around at the bread and bun section sweep clean nothing so i went to the guys i'm just gonna have more bread for no bread no bread guys clean 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 um it wasn't so bad though the line was long to get to the cashier but what i did was to allow my husband to stand in the line and we go and get the stuff uh, and fill up the trolley so we get through at a reasonable time apart from them not having certain stuff that we would have wanted so the rain is coming down guys it's raining it's coming down it's not raining very heavily but it is raining i miss on my elder sister and she is going to tell us about her preparation and how she feel about um burial coming this afternoon and guess what when burial leave here you know very like oh, our home at cayman mm -hmm. so she's gonna tell us how she feel not being in cayman because we know the cayman are the flat area and they easy to flood out and being here today to experience burial with her family um well when i was in the cayman islands <laughs> And when it reads the hurricane season, I'm very stressed, very worried, 
But now I'm in Jamaica, I'm, I'm a bit worried, but not too much. But I'm, I'm worried for my families back over there in the Cayman Islands. But at the moment, right now, I get myself prepared. Yes, I get up my food, get my candles. Yes, I have my lamp, my battery. Yes, I stack up, you know, I'm not gonna be like some people, I saw them, they're not gonna buy anything because no hurricane is not coming. No, we got to be prepared. So it's better to be prepared than later on, you're sorry, it's running up and down. And yeah, well, I guess I'm okay. What do you think about the storm though? Do you think it's gonna hit Jamaica hard? Well it's I think based on what you're seeing, yeah, you know, based about on what here. I'm seeing, yeah. Especially those low line areas, yeah. I think we're gonna get something. We're gonna eat us, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think so. Mummy, be a no mummy man. I'm a bit worried though for those people by Rocky Point. Yes. Especially, yeah, in wow. Portland. Yes. I'm safe in my area, but you know, yeah. still, they are our brothers and sisters, so I'm a bit worried. Still for concerned. Those, yeah, I'm for very them. concerned, yeah. And you know, I was watching the news last night, and um, this lady was saying, We come from Key already. The interviewer was asking her if she's gonna um relocate because she lives in Rocky. Mm -hmm. She said, yes, I said, me leave Kia already. Me not think me I go um me not move go no further. Really? So mm -hmm. and you know sometimes those persons down there in Rocky they're really stubborn. Very stubborn. They're very stubborn. They wait until the hurricane hit and That's then in the, the middle of the night now That's everybody running up and down. Guys, be prepared. Better be safe than to be sorry. To be sorry. Yeah. All right. Anything else from you? No, I guess that's it. So let's wait for it and see. Just have to learn to go some mercy upon us. She got three, my mother, and she will be sharing how she feels about burial coming today. About burial coming today. Burial coming today. And um, I also want her just to recount and share her experience of some of the hurricanes that would have passed during her time. Well, let I first talk about Ivan. Ivan was very dangerous. Ivan come with pickaxe, cutlass, park, everything Ivan come with. When Ivan leave, leave us. Yeah, they touch everybody. Touch everybody. Nothing but was, I was left the unturned. One. I didn't lose a fruit tree. I don't know why I was so lucky, but I didn't lose any fruit Is it tree. luck or blessing? Right? Blessing. God was blessing was in this yard. And they know the incomers went through very fast. But anyhow, you go away with 25 chicken for me. <laughs> 25 chicken dead. Ten goats. And six goats. Four cows. No. <laughs> so, you know, but you know, we give God thanks. They are life still alive. Still alive, and the house stop never blow off at no stand. Right now, Barry is coming. I wake up from 2 o'clock this morning. I couldn't go back to sleep because I'm fretting. Honestly, I'm a fret all night. Reason being, Go to the doctor yesterday, I didn't get to do what I supposed to do. I mean, I wake up this morning, my consider said the storm coming and the house stop will come out this time. <laughs> so, but my daughter was saying, Oh, we have too much money with everything, but I go talk to him about the house stop, no? And yes. So, because, Great. you know, God might not let anything happen. But I believe coming up. After this thing is over, next year I'm not going to fret because I'm going to let that So you're anticipating another storm next year? Yes. You love the storm then? Every year they have just say we are into a stormy month and right from June to November. So we don't know what is going to happen next. My burial don't come as well as she may come, but it's coming down low at three. But I want to manage up at two. We just get a little breeze and a little rain. You know, some people 
them buy out the whole of the supermarket them. When I go to make it yesterday, not even my bread in the supermarket, not even my bun. Nothing inside there. The people them gone home with everything is coming. Yeah, but it's important for them to prepare. But what happened to our life? Me never have any money to buy in the grocery. Eh? You have your children, you have your daughter. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. so the girls them go and do some shopping. Yes. And because made preparation the for you. The girls them say they cannot bother with me. And they'll be safe for a lot of trouble. So I just leave them to do them own things. So we are hoping for the best today. You know, we just have a look at June and June. And we don't have any breeze. Just look at June. Just a little breeze. You know? So we can see where we go from view of what the area looks like um we're having the rainfall not extreme rainfall um just normal rainfall and um you can see the trees growing um i would say dancing in the wind however you it's not heavy wind that we are experiencing at this time here in clarendon Southeast Clarendon to be exact, East Division. I'm in the community of Raymond. So, just giving you a little highlight of what is happening in my area. So, as time progresses, I will continue to update you. It's now after 11, and we know that it's going into the afternoon that we should get the major effects of burial as it passed over. We are going with all the bad things over here. Hey! We are playing Ludi, look where we have to take we leave. Hey, hey! Burial come out strong. Burial come out strong. We can't stay upon the veranda anymore. May I be going inside? Burial come out strong. Look where the leaf are fly all over. Apple tree leaf reach on up front. <laughs> Breadfruit leaf reach on up front, all the way from the back. Mango tree leaf reach on the front, all the way from around the back. Things are going, guys. Be excited. I will be here this way and it don't get any. <laughs> oh my god, don't get any worse. But yeah, things are gone, guys. We're gonna catch it a while ago because I don't matter. Scream out and jump up a little while. Beryl, if this is not a full force, we don't want to see nothing more. We are getting you guys. We they get you. We they get you. Hey, we they get you. Hmm? We they get you. So I guess Barry will trim the trees and just carry all of the leaves and put it here. Drink plum tree gone. Well, not all of it, but a portion of it. Red fruit on the ground. Sow us up. Coconut on the ground. Goats are fine. June plum on the ground and mangoes. <laughs> All right, this um, what a plum tree name? Barry. Some call it Barry. Some say cool plum. It's torn down. And fencing, the fencing over there broken down. River and come down. down, down See, you can, we can't go down no further. Pigs are intact. Pigs are right. 
Mm-hmm. Animals are right. <laughs> and they were like that, they are right. <laughs> yes, and dogs are okay. Houses are right too. To God be the glory. No lives, well, from my end, was taken. So we give God.